Hey everybody. We're actually gonna do like a mukbang today and review some crumble cookies. One of them, I'll be honest, I have tried before and then another I couldn't get because it had almond in it. So just a heads up because of my allergy. To be honest, mostly everything I'm gonna be showing you guys is actually all pink. Sorry, I don't know how to talk about this stuff. I'm really blessed for crumble cookies because, well, I love cookies, but also, they are representing breast cancer awareness. My grandma on my dad's side passed away a long time ago. She lived to be 82, but from breast cancer. And so this goes near and dear to my heart. And I definitely donated because, you know, I just can't imagine that. And I lost a loved one for that. So, yeah, um, it's a little emotional. I miss her dearly. I've been thinking about her a lot this week. I think about like, man, like if I just would have had more time, I would have gotten to know her or she would have got to see me throughout life. You know, I only knew her up until I was like five because then she passed. So it's really tough. So this week in this video is kind of in honor of her. Um, and it's a lot. So everything is going to be very pinky of my mukbang <laughs> is all. So let's get into it. So first I've been dying to go to this barista place called Cowgirl Coffee. It's just like another country themed type of coffee place. And I was just like in love. So I was like, why not? And then in honor also of like this week, I got a pink sticker from them. It's so cute because I collect stickers, but let's give this a try. I just got like coconut and vanilla. I changed it up a little bit as an ice drink. Your girl loves ice. So cheers. Mm. Oh my gosh, whoa. That is bomb. Mmm. Wow. They did not disappoint. It's like extra sweet, like I asked. I love that. And then in Clackamas, I actually went to Chick-fil-A, but I have to be careful Chick-fil-A because they, I found out, make their chicken and peanut oil. But I can have their mac and cheese, which I'm really excited about. Here it is. Oh my goodness. So I figured to try it. I heard it's really good and I can have it. It's made of canola oil, so we're good. And yes, I did grab a fork from inside. <laughs> so, okay, first off, let's like look at it. It looks good. What's this on top? Oh, at first I thought it was bacon. Is it just like extra cheese? I don't I don't know. I don't know. Okay. So I was like, I don't know how I feel on this. Oh my goodness. Whoa, it's cheesy. Let's try it without that piece. I don't know what that is. I need to take a couple more bites. I want to explain the texture. I would say it's pretty good. It's different. I also got water as well. Pink represent. Because it was a long drive today. <laughs> Luckily, I got out of here early and got back here early so i didn't get any like rush hour and then now it gets darker earlier too so it's stressful but worth it the smack and cheese is pretty good it's the texture is definitely very different it's hard to explain i feel like this is like a richer type of cheese it's not like your average craft mac and cheese the cheese is like fancy like bougie it's not what I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be like some basic mac and cheese. It's like richer. So at first that's why I was like, I don't know how I feel on it. The cheese is strong. But it's good. I like. All right. Let's try the cookies now. I'm really excited. Oh my goodness. Let's see. Where do we begin? Let's do this donut cookie. Okay, y'all. Oh my goodness. This donut cookie. Oh, it looks so good with the sunlight. It looks really good. I heard it's like strawberry and vanilla. Oh my gosh. It looks good. Okay. I'm really happy because I'm going to be real. When I was looking at some of the TikTok reviews, I was nervous to try this one. I wanted to try it, but I was nervous because in a lot of the reviews, it looked really dry. This looks so good. I'm like excited. Okay. Let's give it a try. It's subtle, but it's sweet still. All right, y'all, this is the next cookie. It's a strawberry chocolate cheesecake. It's their chilled cookie, and let's try it. Watching a lot of the TikTok reviews, people thought this could have been sweeter. This is, like, sweet enough, honestly. All right, the last one, because I can't have the other one. So this other one, real quick, I can't have. It's this ruby chocolate chip cookie. It's because it has some almond extract, but I'm hoping in one of my holiday vlogs, I'll get to bake ruby cookies at home without any worrying about any almond because obviously i wouldn't put that in so stay tuned because i really want to try a ruby cookie i wanted to try it this week but I couldn't so i just got two of pink velvet but i'll just eat one in the video because <laughs> that one's my favorite and y'all have watched my first crumble review video it was the day i went to vancouver it's in a vlog where i actually tried a pink velvet back when i got crumble cookies for the first time and that one was my favorite and i was like wait are some of these cookies seasonal and i realized that one was a seasonal one and i was like so sad so let's try it again ah I'm so excited it's back baby ah i'm in love this one's my favorite y'all like i would say first place this is my favorite i love the pink velvet it's so popular i'm glad they brought it back mm -mm. 
Oh my gosh, this is so good. It just like melts in your mouth. And that's gonna be all for today's video. Bye y'all. I love you all so much and please stay safe. Mwah.